Bull nearly killed an Army veteran as he shopped for a car in Tracy. A reporter Mark Thompson explains how the victim's own body may have helped save itself. With severe wounds to both sides of his stomach, Dean King rests and recovers as he reflects on the bizarre encounter that landed him here, an encounter with a bull and its horns. It was Wednesday morning when King went to check out a used car on this rural property near Tracy, unaware that an aggressive bull roamed nearby. The next thing he remembers, he was being knocked to the ground and gored twice. King says he hid between a bush and the house on property while the bull stood over him and snorted for some 20 minutes. Finally, King heard a car honk and called out for help, he was rushed to the hospital and underwent surgery, fortunate to be alive. Even at that point, I couldn't really see, see the bull. I heard him snorting, I heard him breathing, and he was down by my feet, and, and he'd, he'd like smell me, and then he'd snort. And I thought, oh, I'm in for it. You know, I thought he was going to go ahead and start horning me some more, try to get me out of that bush. But he didn't. I don't know, I don't know why. He could have. He could have tore that plant out of there like it was nothing. You but thought I, you were going to die. I did. I thought I was going to die. Doctors told King the extra weight around his belly may have saved his life. I don't think so.